hello. I'm uh, doing another pinhole uh, day after Christmas. This is a street scene with these holiday decorations that I really kind of liked in this tree. Uh, somebody has adorned the block with it, which is lovely. And I'm using my DIY box camera there that I built a few weeks ago and talked about in the first video. And uh, there's highlights in the background and I'm kind of exposing for the ornaments in hopes it'll kind of kick out because this is a 90 millimeter focal length on four by five. So I'm hoping to get a nice kind of wide, almost semi distorted uh, from this pinhole image. Uh, it's calculating about uh, two minutes at the longest on the globes and obviously the highlights will burn out. So I'm going to do somewhere around two minutes. So this again is with my DIY pinhole box camera. It's about an F491 from F-Stop. As I said, it's going to be in between a minute and a half and uh, two minutes max. So we're going to get the bulbs and we'll see what comes out. So here we go. All right, so we're ready to expose and I'm going to trip the shutter off here. This is a shutter I kind of designed for this thing. There's a number of ways to do that. So I've got two little strips in there that I glued down in this little block. So I had to slide it up because it was sticking. So I slid it up and we are now exposing. All right, so I've done just about two minutes. I'm going to slide the shutter back over like that. And the design was kind of great, but it's got, and it still needs to be improved because obviously I need the tape on there to hold it down. So. This whole thing is an experiment, but it's been a lot of fun, and I've got, and this is my 10th image with this thing, and it's all from a design that I was inspired to make from a guy named Tony Warren, and also by the way, did an article on constructing a 4x5 DIY, which I think is marvelous, and I've improved it a little bit, at least for me. Jim Gooden on analog photography again, and I've uh, been doing a street scene, uh, with my DIY pinhole camera with these holiday ornaments. So we'll see how it comes out. Thanks for watching.